I'm back. I'm back. To the minute hustle, I go by the name Jaden. If you don't know me, guys, I've been away for a long time and I must apologize. There was so much that went on. I released a new single, which you can see right there. It's the music playing in my background. Oh, yeah, but make sure you check it out on iTunes. Uh, it's not just that. The last time I recorded an episode, yeah, and I checked this last time I recorded because I was busting out them series and they were going really good. I had about four or five episodes ready to upload, yeah? I put it all into my laptop. It was going nice and smoothly on my Vegas Pro, yeah? You know what Vegas Pro is, that, that editing software, yeah? But anyway, it was all going nice and smoothly, yeah? But when I went to render the actual episode, it wouldn't render. Man, I was there for days trying to render these damn episodes and they wouldn't upload. I don't know if it was because it was too big or too long or what it was. And I hope I don't have this problem with these new series because I tell you what, I tell you what, I tell you what, these new series, oh my God. I will teach you so good though. <laughs> but anyway, forget about that. That series, I'm gonna have to just squash it. I might come back to it in the future, I don't know. But I'm gonna be giving you guys something fresh and if you haven't already seen it, I uploaded a post that was showing you a little hint to what was coming. Think like a millionaire. Guys, how many times do we think like a millionaire? Or we wish to be a millionaire? Or we wish to do what the millionaires are doing? But we don't know how. Well, I'm gonna show you how. <laughs> I don't know how to start this whole episode off, but I think it makes sense to talk about what I found online, right? And I've been trying to figure out what it is these millionaires are doing. How are they making all this money? How are they doing it? And why aren't I doing it? And why are you doing it? So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna share with you in these series few things. One, exactly what these millionaires are doing, or at least what I think they're doing, yeah? Two, I'm gonna show you one, na na. Two, na na na. Three, ways of how you can make incomes right now, today, on top of what you're already doing. Because I tell you what, these millionaires, they have more than one source of income. You don't believe me, you can check yourself. I know this, because I've been looking, I've been looking at it. You don't believe me. You need to have more than one source of income. If you're going out working nine to five and you only have one income, that's not enough to make you a millionaire. I mean, you'll get by, like you buy your food, you know, your crunchy nut flakes, because <laughs> that's what I buy. <laughs> crunchy nut flakes, my digestives. <laughs> but it's not enough to give you a solid income to make you a millionaire. And they're doing things what we're not doing. So guys, grab your pen and papers, or your iPads, or whatever you need to get started, and let's do this. I had to write this down on my phone, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I mean, I'm all right, but I'm not like most of these YouTubers. They got things stuck up in here. <laughs> Me, I just make it up as I go along. I don't know, but sometimes I write it down. So look, check this, right? Number one, how to think like a millionaire. Now these guys, when they make their profits, they don't do short term, they do long term. And I'm talking five to 10 years. Now, when I say long term, I mean like, me, I mean, I can go out, I can go down the road, pick up something from that second hand shop and try and sell it the next day, yeah? They don't think like that. They think long term. They think, mm, let me invest into this, yeah? And in five years time, it's gonna grow in profit. And then that's how I'm gonna make my money. And that's a very clever way of thinking, trust me. So I need to program your brains to think like that because I'll tell you what, you guys can do it too. Have you guys seen that book? Um, what's it called? Um, I don't even want to say it wrong, but I think I'm going to. I think it's like Poor Dad, Rich Dad or something like that. Have you seen that? Because I'll tell you what, that book makes a lot of sense. How there's two people, they live, one's rich and one's poor, but they both got their own advice on how the, uh, the, the kids should live. It's an interesting book, you'll have to check that out. I might drop it in the description so you can check it out. But moving on, 
Yeah, we need to understand how these millionaires think in order to become one. So like what I was saying before, we need to have multiple sources of income. It's such an important thing because if you only have one income coming in, that's it, that's all you've got to live off. And some people are struggling when you don't have to. Just check out my videos, man. My videos will help you. If you don't believe me, I will put it in the box up there. Look at it. Click on that and use it. <laughs> Some people are struggling when they don't have to. Now look, I am gonna give you three different ways of making a profit today, right? One will be online. Two will be offline. And three will be passive income. For those who don't know what passive income is, you need to Google that because I ain't got time to be telling you about it. <laughs> Cut it short, it's basically you always have money coming in all the time when you're sleeping, when you're awake, whatever you're doing. That is what I call passive income. That's what these millionaires are doing and that's what we need to be doing, okay? But before I dive too deep into passive incomes and everything else, you need to understand what you're making right now and what you're doing with your own money. Listen, download this app. Can I put it there? Is it popping up? Money fee. It's a perfect app to start yourself right now to control your money and learning how to spend because you don't want to be spending out more than what you're earning because if you are that's a big problem right there that's why people get loans you don't need loans let me tell you something anybody that's on my channel looking right now that has a loan stop that you don't need it you just need to learn how to program yourself and learn how to control your money now this is going to be a long episode i'm looking already in the camera right should be looking i should be looking at you but i'm looking and i can see that i've gone a few minutes already so but i don't care because this information you need to know now money fee is a fantastic app i use it to control what i'm spending what i'm spending out on and what my income is it's fantastic, you can do so much on there. You can put like your bills, you can put like what you're spending on food shops, you can put like all sorts, just check it out, yeah? <laughs> Cause that's gonna help you into taking this next step into coming a bit more wealthy or having a bit more money, yeah? So, <clears throat> I mean these millionaires, what, you think they just become millionaires? Nah, they save, but they have a money managing system. People like to call them, uh, <laughs> people like to call them accountants. Nah, listen, you can do it yourself. Yeah, I mean, later on, when you've got the hundreds and thousands of millions, then you can get an accountant. But right now, you need to learn how to manage your own money. So that means getting yourself an app like Money Fee, where you can put down what you're spending, and you can see your income and see your outcome. Listen, there's another thing that you need to know. Me and every other people that I know that's been successful and wealthy, they tell me, and I've put this in one of my episodes before, they told me, <laughs> you need to learn how to spend a penny, save a penny and put a penny for tax. And if you do this, you will always have money. Now it's hard, I know it's hard. You get a thousand pound a month and like 700 pounds gone on your bills. I know that, but whatever you're left with, even if it is 300 pounds, you need to learn how to manage that. And this is where the Money Fee app comes in great because you put, you spend 100 pounds on whatever you want. And I'm talking after you've done like your bills, your food, shop, whatever. Even if it was just 100 pounds, I don't care. I don't care. Even if it's just 100 pounds. And you will struggle at first. Learn to spend 33 pounds. Save 33 pounds and put 33 pounds away for tax. And I tell you why, because you don't know when that tax man's gonna come. But when he comes, he's gonna want the money. And if you don't pay him, that's where you get done. No, I won't take it, I won't take it. <laughs> I don't know why I'm walking off. <laughs> Learn how to manage your money, please. It really is important. Money Fee is a fantastic app. There's probably loads of apps out there, but Money Fee is just the one I'm saying to use because I know it's free and it works well, right? So once you understand how to control your money, we can then look at how you can bring in more money. Because there's no point in me teaching you to make a profit if you don't know how to control the money. <laughs> so learn that. <laughs> right. I told you I need to get my phone for this. I ain't joking. I'm not joking. You want to see it. You will see my notes, so I put it here for you. I will do this for you. Alright. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna have to like snip this in and out. I don't care. You know what? I don't even care. You can see one there. This is what you like. You like it fresh. Yeah. <laughs> right. So 
let's dive into this, right? So, income number one, online income. Let me stand to the side like this, because I'll tell you what, you know that bloody hustle pad's coming up. <laughs> this is where you need to start writing stuff down. Online income, that's number one. I found a product for you guys, and oh my God, let me tell you something, I didn't even know this existed this cheap. And when I say cheap, I mean cheap. Guys, check this product. You see that? That's a smart watch. But guys, look at the price. Between two to six dollars, that's dollars. And this is on Alibaba, by the way, yeah? You're looking about three to five pounds or something like that, but look at this. When I look at this, yeah, this reminds me of them Samsung gear watches where you can change, change like, the face of your gear watch and they look nice as well. They're not no cheap tacky crap. They look all right. For three to five pounds, they look all right, yeah? So when I saw this product, I was like, right, my mini hustlers need to do this, yeah? <laughs> this is what you do. I'll buy these at five pounds, yeah? And then I'll knock them out 15 pounds a piece. Bomba! That's 10 pounds profit already just on these products alone. And these will fly your hands. You know how many kids are out there that want these smart things, these smart watches, smart phones, but mums are like, nah, nah, you're gonna break it. I ain't spending 80, 90 pounds. Nah, listen, 15 pounds is not bad to pay to please a little kid for a present. You know, <laughs> and this links up to all sorts. Like you can link it up to, for, for example, if adults want to use it, you know, you can link it up to your iPhone, your, your Android. It links up to everything, man. I'm going to put the link in the description so you can check it out. But this is the sort of product that you want to be selling online. You buy it cheap on Alibaba and then you flog it elsewhere. eBay, Etsy, whichever site you want to use. I would use eBay. I'll probably make a free web store as well. Knock it up there and just plaster it all in Facebook groups and then let them come to yours because sometimes you don't need to be uh, taking profit through eBay. You can do it yourself if you know how. But yeah, guys, between 30 and 60 pounds is what you're, sp uh, you're spending to get 10 of them. And then you imagine you're knocking 10 out at 15 pounds each. I don't even care if you knock them out at 10 pounds each, but I'll knock them out at 15 because I know I can sell them at 15, yeah? So if I can, I know you can as well, but you work the math, 15 times 10 is 150 pounds. Boom, bah! Are you mad? This is what I'm saying, guys. <laughs> this is something that you can do as an income. Now look, you might buy more. You might sell 10 really fast, I don't know. Because from the moment people see it online, people might click, 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 buy, click, buy. You know, Christmas is coming, birthdays are always around the corner. People might buy this out your hands quick, so you might end up buying more than just 10. But I'm just going on the basis of you buying 10. Because you know what, you start off with 10, you see how the product sells, and then boom, you take it from there, yeah? So let's say that you sell 10 and, you're, and it, it sells fast and you come back with another 10, come back with another 10. You come, do you know what I mean? Just, you'll be making good money on this. This is a good way to have a nice little online business, selling this product, yeah? And the only way you're gonna find these products is if you're checking me out. Because if you ain't checking me, you ain't finding these. <laughs> Some people ain't got time to be sitting there looking for products. Oh, well, my mum got to see this before you, but she's lucky, yeah? But guys, you are the next people seeing this. No one else has seen this. This is so cheap and it looks nice. Look at that. <sighs> so you have your online income already, right? Nice little product there for you. This will sell. You can, it depends on how you are, but you could probably sell loads, right? But this is a great little product to run online, right? Now we look at your offline income. Now, when I say offline income, I mean you going out there and selling your product face to face, eye to eye. <laughs> Guys, check this out. Oh my days. Everybody, and when I say everybody, I mean everybody loves tattoos. But this is just ain't them normal black tattoos, because I've seen, I've seen them, you know, old school tattoos where, you know, you've got the stencil, like you've got the stencils here, yeah? And it's just a little uh, <laughs> airbrush, it's airbrush all black. And it comes off, because I used to go to Butlins, yeah? And I used to see it, you just get a nice little black stain on your arm. <laughs> Guys, this is glitter tattoos. Now, let me tell you something. I have been watching this industry for a long time, real long time, and I haven't put it up, but I feel it's time to put this up and to let you guys reap some of the rewards on this because this is fantastic. And you know what the best part is? If you've got kids, if you've got kids, 
your kids can help you sell this business. Listen, you could take it into schools with your kids when you finish school or before school. You could go down the beach on weekends. You can walk through that shopping mall. You can do whatever you want to do. Listen, there's places like parks and all that sort of stuff there that have inside cafes, right? And I've seen them and I know you've seen them and I know you know I knew you've seen them as well. Trust me. You could hire a little area in there or speak to the cafe manager and say, listen, I want to do these temporary tattoos for kids, they're glitter tattoos, yeah? And say, I don't mind giving you a car if you let me just sit there and do my thing. And they be like, yeah, sure, do it, it's okay. What, I'm getting that? Oh yeah, sure. <laughs> they won't mind. There's so many ways that you can generate an income from this tattoo stuff. Let me bring it back, yeah? <laughs> This is a badass product. When I saw this, I was like, yeah, has to be given to you guys because there's so much money to be made on this. It's qualified for skincare, so you know, you know, I mean, there's gonna be some people that may be allergic, but that's, you know, mothers know that. Mothers know, oh, you can't have a tattoo because you're allergic to that on your skin. But, you know, it's fine for kids and fine for adults. This thing's been tested and it's fine. And if you wanna be extra safe, you can check that in the reviews and in the comments and in the item description upon buying, yeah? But as far as I'm aware, these are friendly on the skin, friendly for kids, friendly for adults, and they work perfectly. So I would definitely buy this. Look at the price. See that? What's about 10 pounds? When you, when, you, when you talk about postage as well, that's about 10 pounds. And you get 120 stencils. <sighs> and look at the glitter colors, guys. You get 120 stencils, loads of glitter colors. You basically got the whole set there for you, ready to go. You just buy it. When it comes, you walk out on the beach and boom, you start selling that. That's how simple it is. And if you wanted, you could print off a nice little A4 sheet saying uh, glitter tattoos or whatever you want to call it, yeah? Rainbow tattoos, whatever you want to call it, yeah? <laughs> and then you just sell that. You know, you got your little plastic chair, nice little table, and then kids come along and boom, done. Have a little mirror ready as well to show them. They're going, ah, ah, mommy, look, mommy, mommy, look. Yeah, this is nice. Eh, bugu, eh, bugu. Like, come, let us go. No, we will go and get a eh, fifi and then we will go there. <laughs> Trust me, Efifi is my African name for this whole series. I don't care. <laughs> Efifi, do you want one? Okay, make sure you wash the dishes and then I will give it to you. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm rambling on, sorry. So yeah, <laughs> this product is fantastic, especially if you're gonna be doing it with your kids. Cause the kids sell it for you, man. You know how hype your kids are. Look at my tattoo, oh, you should get this. By that point, the, the kids are already sucked in. Mommy, mommy, I want this one. And you know what I'd do? I would knock them out at like two pounds. Two pounds. You don't need to go more than two pounds because two pounds is nice. You start spending three, you start charging three or four or five pounds. Swear to God, I'll go online and I'll buy them stuff. Where's my stuff? Swear to God, you think, you think I'm joking? You try to charge me three, four? Swear to God, I'll show you now. You try to charge me for your folks? <laughs> Swear to God! Where's my stencils? I will find my stencils! You think I'm doing it? Try to charge me there? Where's my stencils? You know, lady charge me that price, I'll get my own stencils. You think I'm doing it? You think I'm doing it? <laughs> Hear me talking in the background. I will buy my own stencils. Look! I've got these stencils! I know about this business, I told you I've been looking a long time. Look, when I give you guys these things, it's not because I'm saying, uh, yeah, you might make a bit of money. It's because I see the potential. And I see it so bad that I go out and buy it myself because I know I've got the stencils, guys. Look at this, look. Look at this. Ugh, I'm dropping the stencils. I've got all these stencils. Look at that. I've got them all. And they come, they come in bags and bags. Look at that. That's like a Harry Potter. You don't know about what I've got. Trust me. Gryffindor! <laughs> Trust me guys, I've got these stencils, I've got the, I've got the whole kit. Because I tell you what, I see the potential and I will do it with my kids. And even if I don't have my kids with me, I'll do it myself because I know that's the way to make money. So I am so hyped, I haven't even had Red Bull yet. <laughs> I was just trying to show you that I ain't joking about, yeah? So look, you knock these out at two pounds a piece. You only need to do 50 kids. That's not a lot, you know? You know, you're standing on a beach like on Brighton, or you know, you're in the shopping mall, 
you get kids everywhere, especially on the weekends as well. But on, on a daily basis, mums walk through you all the time with their kids, before school, after school, at three o'clock. Trust me, kids are everywhere and you see this, and they will see this, and they will want it. Two pounds is not a lot. And then they can choose colours, just say, look, two colours, choose, choose a colour, blue and pink, you want blue and pink, yeah? Oh, here they go. Because you just basically, you stick the steps along, you get the glue, and then you get the glitter. Boom, 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 done. It takes about a minute, two minutes, max. You ain't looking longer than two minutes. And that's done. Kids walking away happy with bloody Gryffindor on his bloody arm. <laughs> or the, the, what's it, the cider hat, whatever it is. Look, whatever stencils that it comes with, you can buy loads. There's so many stencils online, you can buy them. If you want to be original, you can buy them, right? But you knock out 50 kids a day. That is not hard. 50 kids. Trust me, that is not hard. At two pound, that's a hundred pound a day. Bomba. You work that out over 10 days. That's a thousand pounds. Bomba. Just these two products alone in 10 days, right? Hold on, hold on, hold on. let me finish, let me finish. So over a month, just this one product alone, based on 50 kids a day, that's 3,000 pounds over 30 days. Bomba. Even if you did just half that kids, even if you did just 25 kids a day, yeah? And that is super easy. <laughs> You, let's say you just did 25 kids a day, and then you did that over 30 days, that's still half that price, that's half a free grand, that's 1,500, plus that extra 150 pounds that you're taking on your online product. Do you see what I'm saying? And I haven't even got into the third income yet. <laughs> so guys, check this out, look. That's your, on, that's your offline income. Let's move on to the third one, passive income. Now before I discuss this, I need to let you know, I am not your financial advisor, yeah? I have to let you know that. Because when it comes to making passive incomes, and it depends how you do it, to be fair, with any money, with any money that you do, with any money that you spend, any advice that you're getting from someone online, they're not your financial advisors. I'm not your financial advisor, right? So I cannot be held responsible for what you decide to do with your money. I can only advise you of what I'm doing and what I think can work, yeah? But I had to let you know that, okay? <laughs> but guys, passive income is an important part to how you become a millionaire because this is what millionaires are doing. And for this particular passive income, oh, I need to discuss it because I've been doing so much research over the last six months on this particular topic. It's called cryptocurrency. Some of you may have heard of it, some of you haven't. But I know some of you have heard of the name Bitcoin, right? Now listen, Bitcoin is one coin of many cryptocurrencies out there, right? But the one we're going to be focusing on in particular is called XRP. Think of this like a tip for me to you. Listen. I need to show you a few things, right? So check this out. Back in 2018, last year, January, XRP shot up in price. If I want to go a bit further, I can say back in 2017, just before, XRP was less, was worth less than a penny. Now you guys need to understand this, right? XRP was worth less than a penny. It shot up in 2018 to two pounds, two pounds 50, maybe almost three pounds, right? You can see it, you can see it here, it's not a joke, right? There's so many people sleeping on cryptocurrency that does not realize, and so many people that are afraid of it because they don't understand it. But if you knew what I knew, oh my God, trust me. So right now, as it stands, XRP is sitting on roughly 20 to 21 pence per coin, per crypto coin. If you, took a hundred pounds out of your pocket right now and you invested it into cryptocurrency at 20 pence yeah you would get roughly 500 coins if you haven't got 100 pounds fine invest whatever you can invest i always tell my people to invest whatever they can afford right because that's what you should be doing in any investment, that's what you should be doing, yeah? Invest what you can afford, what you can only afford to lose as well, by the way. 
So don't be going and investing like your whole, <laughs> your month's worth of rent into whatever it is, because you don't want to be doing that. Just invest whatever change you've got. So like I said to you, for example, you've got 100 pounds and you want to split that three ways, I would take 33 pounds and invest that. <laughs> Instead of putting it in my savings, I just throw it into an investment. And I see this as a fantastic investment because look at the price, 20 pence. It was at two pounds before. Listen, this will go back up. And when it hits two pounds again, that's 10 times your profit already. <sighs> Bomba. Do you see, to me, that's what I class as a fantastic passive income. You know, some of these coins are expected to go higher. I might be wrong. This coin right now, this XRP, might hit 10, 15, 20 pounds. If it hits 20 pounds, <laughs> you'd be sitting on a fortune based on 100 pounds, but I'm going on just 100 pounds investment today could make you 10 times your profit back when it hits two pounds. And it's gonna hit two pounds again, guys. So this is something to really think about, yeah? I'm not going to dive too deep into it. You do your own research. You can check on YouTube, check online, look at cryptocurrency. This is what the passive income is for this episode, okay? I'm going to be giving you different episodes, different uh, passive incomes for different episodes, but I really am fond of this and I really see the potential in it. Going over everything, again, you know, from everything that I've just said today, you would be looking at, uh, at the bare minimum, by the way, £1,600 cash that's at the bare minimum i've got three grand sitting there but like i said if you did it if you did what you did the offline thing with the tattoos at, and you only did, did 25 kids a day which is easy by the way you know you at the bare minimum you're looking at 1005 plus the 150 1650 quid that's that's not even including your passive income because this could go any higher anything higher yeah <laughs> And this passive income, by the way, is long-term hold. I'm talking hold that down for a couple of years because we need to start thinking long-term. So you have an income, you have your online income, your offline income that's generating multiple sources for you now, plus whatever you're doing, because you might be working already, you might be stacking uh, shelves in Tesco's, I don't know, yeah? But what I'm saying is you've got these incomes on top of that, yeah? And then you've got your passive income, which in this case is an investment which is in cryptocurrency, the XRP. You hold that long term. I would say two to three years, because I guarantee you in two to three years, we could be pleasantly surprised. And if you wanted, over the course of that time, invest more into it. Keep investing. Because I tell you what, the more money you put in, it will grow. And once it reaches that limit, meaning once that XRP shoots up, because what goes up must come back down, but it will go up. Once it goes up, you could be sitting on some serious money. And this is what the millionaires are doing. This is how they think. They think long term on what they can invest in. We used to think that, well, I used to think that you had to have thousands of pounds to invest into like property, real estate and all that stuff, but you don't. You just need to understand what it is that you're trying to invest in and how you can make a living from it. Especially something long term like this. This is something that you should really look into guys. And this is basically what my whole Think Like a Millionaire episodes are gonna be about, yeah? I'll be giving you those three different ways of income. What's my phone doing making that noise? <laughs> I'll be giving you three different types of incomes, really sitting you down talking about how millionaires think, because I tell you, they think insane, yeah? And basically just giving you the opportunity, the opportunity to have a great life and a great living, yeah? Because this is what I'm doing. Everything I tell you is what I'm doing, by the way. You might not believe it, but this is what I'm doing. I'm trying to create a living. This is what we do, so we can look after our families and our, you know, our friends, close friends, and all that stuff. I have spoken too much. I don't know how this went down for a first episode of Think Like a Millionaire, but if you liked it, please smash that like button or tap it or click it, whatever you wanna do. Give me some likes. I want 10 likes on this video. I'm happy with 10 likes, yeah? And make sure you click my subscribe button, which I'm gonna bust in. <laughs> this corner, I'll put my subscribe button there. Click it and stay with me. Click my notifications bell too, so you don't miss no. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>